Hi everybody, this is Julie. So this is the tag flip that I made. We're gonna go ahead and take it apart and put it back together so that I can show you what we have in here and how the tags turned out. Okay, so we need to be further away um, so that you'll be able to see all this. So I have made a tassel, but it's a working tassel. So, um, okay, so we're going to go ahead and pull this, pull this off. Okay, so these are just an assortment of, um, laces and ribbons things that i had pulled out to use in here and i've gone ahead and put them in here i used one of the white rings from my mom's stash i've tied it with um eyelash trim gold eyelash trim and this little bouquet of flowers this can all be taken apart to be used in projects that the um the recipient will be getting so our first little card is a pre-made little card from, um, I believe this one was from Michael's and it has on the top some gold eyelash trim. We call it Georgia eyelash trim cause Georgia gave it to me. <laughs> and then down here I have a collage and it has a piece of the paper. You're going to see this piece, this paper was used throughout so there's kind of a theme going on here it's obviously it's fairies um and then we have a couple of blues some purple and the pinks that are going through here also you're going to see the daisies all throughout and they were from this you're going to see the vine i have this vine that i used it was from hobby lobby and I have this vine that I used, also from Hobby Lobby. This one, you get six yards. I got it at 50% off, so six yards for $2. That was really good. The other one was $7, so three fifty dollars for six yards. Okay, and um, I did use a, a piece, maybe a couple pieces of that in here so i have some washi tape here that was um that large thick washi tape that i got at spectrum art creations and down here i used one of the tim holtz little things i think this came from his new curator snippets love that package and the um the lace down here as well okay and i stamped on the back some lines for uh journaling and some more of the little daisies so that is the little one then i added a, a flower i just punched a hole in it so that it could go on here and she can use that somewhere else in another project if she wants or she can keep it in here if she just keeps this together so here we have a tim holtz card for the bottom, some more of those little curator. I think this little um, floral is from the Field Notes snippet. This was the piece of lace that I cut off from here. I made a little pocket. We did find that we need to put these um, fairy stickers. So the these fairy stickers, we needed to back them with white. So I used a variety of scrap papers to to back them we also have one of the stickers of the butterfly up here and then we we did create a little pocket here and so behind there is a little ticket and this card is part of the pocket okay and this is already um cool on the back so we just left it here we have our next one i did go ahead if you watched the four hour <laughs> video of me making all of this so there is a live video of me making all the tags here um 
and adding in some of the items that I'm gifting because this is Happy Mail, so I have added some items in. Um, but after I did come back and I added the tag toppers, okay, and most of them I just cut them out of the tassel because the tassel was really long, and so so this one is a playing card, and then it's been collaged. And you'll see all through that there's pixie dust on the flowers because they're magical and on the wings and um, on some of them on the flowers on the little fairies. And so the pixie dust, I get that from my 544 fingernail polish from Dollar Tree. Love that. And um, here's some more of those little daisies down here. This is another little um, cluster that we made with some lace and that. Okay, so here is a little bunch of bulb pins. And here is a little mason jar. And it's got a fairy mix in here. There's a glass leaf. There's a key, a butterfly, some pearls some eyelets, some buttons, just a variety of fun items. Here, oh, I didn't want to, you know what? We're going to go ahead and put that on a bulb pin. Um, these little tags, we're going to take them off, and this time I'm going to put them on a bulb pin so, so they don't get lost. <clears throat> okay, so I have... I have these two tags. Okay, so we'll go ahead and put the bulb pin on these. Okay, and then we have this little tag. And that's uh, from the jewelry area at Michael's. This one also. You'll see we used... Um, we use some of these in the journal as well. And so I'm gifting her a couple of them to use in her own projects. Okay. Whoa. Okay, so that one came undone. So we'll just tie it. Um, these little jewelry tags with the gold on them. Those I got from Spectrum Art Creation. And you're going to hear that name a lot. Um, I like to go to her crafty Saturday sales. Um, it's a lot of fun. There's games. There's good chat. <laughs> and good products. Lots of, lots of products, lots of fun. Okay, so there I've added those on there so I don't have to, if I take this apart again, I don't have to keep worrying about where they are. Okay, so for our next one, I had this ticket. So this is a ticket from um, Spectrum Art Creations, and I'll show you the back since we're here. I added one of the little jewelry tags here. I put these on. Um, these stickers on on top of the string there and then that's on a tag and all of this is added into this little pocket we flipped this pocket up added this um, forget me not from Tim Holtz uh, I don't know which one that's called maybe botanicals I don't know but I got I have flowers and then I added those there and then in the pocket we have another Tim Holtz flower. We have um, Daisy and some daisies from da Field of, or Daisy Field Digital Kit from the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop. They're printed on cardstock and cut out. And I believe that's from the, the, the mini, mini journal, junk journal kit. Okay. Um, so, and you get that in the digital deluxe. So you get little tiny pieces that can be little tiny cards like that. I added these leaves. I had picked up this. Let me show you. I picked up this bush from Michael's to be fairy leaves. So that's um, 
that's where those came from and I just stapled them on. I stamped a ticket that was in one of the um, October crafty paper or paper crafty prompts. And so I, the hole is there. We've got lace. We have one of the images from Fairies of Summer. There's some of the vine. We've got daisies in three places. And I added a double daisy onto the tag string and it flips around. So I think that that one's really fun. I love, I love the wings on there as a tag topper. So here's some stickers. And then we have, this was a recipe card in my mom's stash. I added the hole and hole reinforcer. We've got some grow grain ribbon and the vine. I think that was a perfect topper for this because it's soft, it doesn't fight. We've got the little fairy down here with a library card from one of the Tim Holtz package. And this is a tag from Joann's from their flowers. You get an extra sticker, some tickets, and some more cards from Daisy Kits from the Dear Julie Julie um, Daisy Field digital kit. There's a scrap paper that matches and a little punch and another Daisy card. Okay, so those are just, and they're just in this little pocket that we made down here. Okay, whoop. Them all in there and put her in from the side she's trying to she's trying to open the stickers trying to open okay but there's a sticker and then I love this card it reminds me of my mom and my grandma <laughs> so this one is on a one of my Cricut tags that I make we've got some of those ribbon roses a feather, more of the forget-me-nots, some more of the pixie dust, the daisies, and a love word sticker. And it's backed by a piece of the paper and one of these fun little label things. Okay. Next we have, this one was named the boho card when we were, or the boho tag when we were um, filming this. I did this live. And it just, it has this um, sparkly, uh, gauzy ribbon up here. It's so fun. And then a jewelry tag with love and the daisy. And I cut the daisy um, where the tag was. Added some of the fingernail polish to the butterfly. Excuse me. So this little bouquet, this bouquet holder and these two flowers and the leaf were from a sticker sheet and I had those pieces left. I went ahead and stuck this little bouquet in here. We've got our little fairy here with her pixie dust on her wings and another one of those ribbon roses and the doily, the gold doily. So you can see the little paper clip here and that is holding a couple of the tickets from um, Spectrum Art Creations and a violet. This is from the wrapping paper that I use all the time and then a little stamped book page dilly bobber there. So that's the boho tag. And then we have the um, some of the doilies. Next, we have a book page pocket. Okay, so I had an I have an old book, and I made a book page pocket. I added some um, lined paper. This is washi tape. We have a hole reinforcer here and a hole reinforcer here. I zigzagged the pocket closed. Added a collage here, including a flower. This is one of the little pieces from Tim Holtz, and then we have. Our little fairy with her pixie dust here and then we've made a build a pocket this is the image I just thought a, a fairy should live there and so you get a fairy another fairy sticker some more little cards from Daisy Field another 
scrap paper, you get some of the words from the wrapping paper and another Daisy Field card. Okay, so, and those all just go right down into that pocket. Now, like this is a pocket card. So over here we have a little shaker card. It's just got some butterflies and some gold in there. And there's an image from Fairies, Flutters, and Flowers digital kit from the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop. And also a couple of um, these that, that she can use in her own projects. Okay, so that is that one. Okay, so we put the Put this in first and then add those. Okay, and this heart goes like right on the edge. And these go behind it. Okay, then here we have added some of the Georgia eyelash trim to the top of this. There's this little piece of crochet um, here, and then one of the little jewelry tags decorated here. Here's another one of the images of the summer fairies, or fairies of summer, and another one of the daisy with the vine, and we added one of the blue flowers from Tim Holtz here. There's just this little punched out card that's right there, and you can write on the back of this. It's a Tim Holtz um, card. I love those. I, um, love those. It's you, it, you're, it comes with four different sizes, four or five different sizes of cards in the package. This is the first tag that we made during the live video. And it is a large postcard that I picked up on Amazon. I added the flower and a little bit of the, and the feather here and the, um, hole reinforcer has the sparkly fingernail polish on it. And then we added two pockets down here and then some washi tape and a couple of the little tiny images from fairies of summer. I did gift her a couple pieces of the Daisy sticker. Um, and then in the small pocket, We have a ticket, some of the cards from the Daisy Field digital kit, and is there two tickets? Just one. This ticket has a name on it, which is kind of fun. And then um, a tag that I made from like a the cover of a paper pad. Okay. Then in the second pocket and it's stitched around the outside um, because I used this paper and it did not, this did not stick to that paper. So I had to sew it. So that is some origami paper that I had in my stash, a blue tag that I had, a craft tag, and then I made this little tag. Okay. And so, like I said, there is a, um, four hour live video that you can watch of me making all of this. You can go ahead and speed it up to two times the normal speed. And I still kind of talk pretty normal if you do that and it'll go by much faster. <laughs> okay. So this one has some of the, this is a piece of a tablecloth. Okay. I added some paper to the back so I could turn it into a tag and we have the, but it also could go on something as a flip. I think that would be really cool. Um, a couple of these flowers from the Tim Holtz thing. There's our little tiny fairy stamp or sticker. Some of the words from the wrapping paper, a large flower with one of the Tim Holtz pieces on the inside. This little um, butterfly came it's on the page that these um, fairies of summer were on. I also added some of the daisies and of course the 
the glittered fingernail polish and then this tag here is um has i added this topper to it with lace and then some of the pink lace the avocado dyed lace and some of the vine and we have one of those cards with the image uh, ripped out and put on and then the pixie dust added to the card and we have our vine with our daisy and our vine with our daisy here we have a card that is put behind there and a ticket with a name on it there and so yeah so there we go and the way and then i used this um this ring it's a uh it's not the largest ring. The largest ring that I have, I get in the, it's, it's in the embroidery section and it's made to you to hold those little, when you put embroidery thread on a, um, on a little plastic thing, it'll hold all those. Or, um, if you're just holding your embroidery thread on there. Okay. So we're going to go ahead, put this Back. Oh, did I show you the back of this? So on the back we have a pocket. And in the pocket we have a butterfly from one of the Tim Holtz things. I think that's, it might be from one of my other things. Um, some digital images from fairies, flutters, and flowers. So you get a couple of those. And, whoops. <laughs> Okay, so those are part of Fairies, Flutters, and Flowers. This is the mini, part of the mini journal kit. Okay, um, so the butterfly, the digital images, some cut-aparts that I thought would match or go with this, and a couple of tag um, tag pieces ready to be made into a tag. Okay. Okay. So that's, that's the big one and it's got those in it. So, um, so the, I, I would call this a loaded tag flip because it's got the extra items in it for the recipient to take out and use in her own stuff. And, um, I think it's, I think this turned out really, really fun. So lots of little things in here. Um, just adding our, those. And most of the holes are reinforced in some way, shape or form. So have you ever made a tag flip? And, um, what else would you put in here? I was, um, I, 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 th I think I might've even overfilled this, but I couldn't find the instructions of what exactly I was supposed to do, to be quite honest. Um, because when I was setting up for this, um, I was behind. I forgot. Actually, I forgot that I signed up for it. Okay, let's go ahead and put some of these in here. Just go that way. What the? Okay, so um, if you're looking for a way of sending happy mail, maybe you are part of Oops, do you see what I just did? I put those last ones all on upside down after. Okay, so this one, oh, it's coming undone. It's, oh, it's okay. It's just, okay, so it needs to go right side up. Right side up. And then this one, yeah, yeah, this one. Oh yeah, that made it so much easier since those tags are attached to that big tag. <laughs> so much easier. Okay, we'll put this 
right here. And I just did this so that it would have some of the pink um, that we had in those two two tags. Well, and it, we ended up with some of that in a few of the tags. Okay. So, oh, we've got our we got our tassel. Okay, so that is my fairy tag flip. So would you be happy to get that? I don't, you guys, I don't know what her style is. I hope she likes it. And um, I, I think it turned out really pretty. How many did we end up with? One, two, these two are considered one. So that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we have twelve tags plus all of the, you know, there's a couple tags in there that are parts of other ones. So. Um, yeah, so I need to go ahead and get this in the mail. And so I hope she enjoys it. Find something to celebrate every day. Do you like these 430 flip throughs? Um, I think it's kind of a fun idea. It gives you something when you wake up in the morning to uh, check out. And I have several journals that I've just finished. So we'll be doing a flip through for several days, the 430 flip, the 430 flip on Dear Julie Julie. So a little extra thing and have an amazing day. I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, don't forget to pray for all of the people that are here on our channel. If you are a member and you join us in our live chat, um, at the premieres, you know that we have several people going through some, some, some stuff and they need your prayers and we need your prayers. And so have an amazing day. Bye. Bye-bye. Beautiful fairy tag embellishments Dear Julie Julie made today for Happy Mail.